teacher, one book and one pen can change the world. Education is one of the blessings of life and one of its necessities. But things did not remain the same. Women were flogged. People were killed. There were beautiful dreams turned into nightmares. Education went from being a right to being a crime. When my world suddenly changed, my priorities changed too. I had two options. One was to remain silent and wait to be killed. And the second was to speak up and then be killed. I chose the second one. The terrorists tried to stop us. But neither their ideas nor their bullets could win. We survived. And since that day, our voices have grown louder and louder. Why is it that countries which we call strong are so powerful in creating wars but are so weak in bringing peace? Why is it that giving guns is so easy but giving books is so hard? Why is it that making tanks is so easy but building schools is so hard? We are living in the modern age and we believe that nothing is impossible and today I'm very happy that we are together fighting for an important cause. This award is not just for me, it is for those forgotten children who want education. It is for those frightened children who want peace. It is for those voiceless children who want change. I'm here to stand up for their rights, to raise their voice. It is not time to pity them. It is time to take action. So it becomes the last time that we see a child deprived of education. Not just the politicians and the world leaders. We all need to contribute. Me, you, we. It is our duty. It has become the first generation that decides to be the last that sees empty classrooms, lost childhoods, and wasted potentials. Let this be the last time that a girl or a boy spends their childhood in a factory. Let this be the last time that a girl is forced into early child marriage. Let this be the last time that a child loses life in war. Let this be the last time that we see a child out of school. Let this end with us. Let's begin this ending together, today, right here, right now.